We're at the Yamugi Franken HQ here in West Boylston, Massachusetts, and I'm here with Dylan, and we're gonna dig into the multi-tap line. But Dylan, really quick for the people out there, why should they keep watching? Where does this shine? The multi-tap is a high-performance tap design that is a good performer in all around your, your common job shop materials, you know, your high mix shops where you, you don't know what the next job is gonna be cutting. Okay, so for specifically for the multi-tap line then, what is your offering? Uh, do you offer cut taps, roll form? What's that look like? All of the above. Okay. So we offer cut taps in your, your typical spiral flute design for blind holes, yeah. pull the chips up out of the hole, the spiral point grinds to push the chips through the hole. Yeah. Um, we also offer the cut taps with extended length for those hard to reach situations in the bottom of a cavity or with a side wall you have to get get around and uh, we also have them in in the form the cold forming taps so do you offer different coatings in these taps or are they all the same coating yes yeah, so we have a uh, steam oxide coating for the cut taps and a TICN coating for the cut taps okay. as, a, as an option um, and we also have a tin coated version for the roll form design and a TICN coated version for the roll form. What about your offering for thread sizes in these lines? So the standard length cut taps, we start at the number four size and go all the way up to the one inch diameter and your UNC and UNF. Uh, for the extended length cut taps, we start at the number six size and go all the way up to the five eighths diameter. UNC oh, UNF. Which is really nice, especially for horizontals and five axis where you need that extended reach. Yes. So Very good. do you offer anything outside of those, anything with NPT or anything like that? Yes, that's actually the, the newest inclusion to the multi-tap line. We now offer NPT, NPTF designs with skip tooth um, and, and TICN coating with spiral flute to, to really pull that big mess of material up out of an NPT thread. What's one of the benefits for the skip tooth? I've been seeing more of those. So why did you guys go with the skip tooth design for the NPT? So the skip tooth actually helps alleviate the chip clogging that tends to occur in the NPT and PTF threads okay. because you have 100% thread height. And a lot of people don't want to take the time to prepare the taper on the minor diameter first. Yeah. So you have an excess of material that you have to get out of there. And the skip tooth de design helps prevent uh, premature tap failure due to just an overload of chips. Yeah, I don't think anyone watching right now would ever want to have tap failure on their machine. It's no, not a lot of fun. It's not fun. So when we're talking about trying to avoid tap failure, how would you recommend for the people out there watching, they hold their taps? Absolutely, yes. So when you're in a machine with rigid tapping cycle, even if it's a newer machine, there's always going to be a little bit of variation with what the controller is telling the spindle rotation is to what the feed rate is. So we have the soft synchro tap holder line that's specifically intended to be used with a rigid tapping cycle, uh, but has a, a small spring element that allows a, a, a minor amount of play to alleviate the torque spikes involved with the tapping process. And I mean, Winning tap breakage is the whole name of the game. That's right. When it comes to materials, before we finish off here, Dylan, what material range can I throw these multi-taps in? So I've I've run successful tests um, in, in your soft, mild carbon steels, alloy steels, hardened alloy steels. As long as you're below 38 Rockwell C scale, yeah. um, the multi-tap can work well. Um, your soft gummy stainlesses, your 300 series, your austenetics, uh, as well as hardened stainlesses. For the hardened stainlesses, you want to stay below about 36 Rockwell seed scale. Um, and then also, you know, your non-ferrous alloys, your brasses, your coppers, your aluminums. Um, I've, I've seen this tap work in, in a, a wide range of materials. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. Absolutely.